The Chinese Fairy Book Chapter 5 The Magic Cask Once upon a time there was a man who dug up a big earthenware cask in his field. So he took it home with him and told his wife to clean it out. But when his wife started brushing the inside of the cask, the cask suddenly began to fill itself with brushes. No matter how many were taken out, others kept on taking their place. So the man sold the brushes and the family managed to live quite comfortably. Once a coin fell into the cask by mistake. At once the brushes disappeared and the cask began to fill itself with money. So now the family became rich, for they could take as much money out of the cask as ever they wished. Now the man had an old grandfather at home, who was weak and shaky. Since there was nothing else he could do, his grandson set him to work, shoveling money out of the cask. And when the old grandfather grew weary and could not keep on, he would fall into a rage and shout at him angrily, telling him he was lazy and did not want to work. One day, however, the old man's strength gave out, and he fell into the cask and died. At once the money disappeared, and the whole cask began to fill itself with dead grandfathers. Then the man had to pull them out and have them buried, and for this purpose he had to use up again all the money he had received. And when he was through, the cask broke, and he was just as poor as before. Note, The Magic Cask is a traditionally narrated tale. In northern China, wooden casks or barrels are unknown. Large vessels open at the top, of earth or stone are used to hold water and other liquids.